There is no honor among thieves, but 47 states aren't taking any chances. They've established ways to discipline judges just in case they find his honor among the thieves. Hear ye! Hear ye! The court's in session. The court's in session now. Here come the judge. Here come the judge. Order in the courtroom! We love the law! Impeachment and recall elections were the only ways to get a judge off the bench in 1960. But since that time, every state except Washington, Maine, and Mississippi have established some kind of body to judge the judges. This way I can personally see that you're persecuted to the full extent of the laws. These commissions investigate complaints, and in the past four years alone, 52 judges have been censured for their conduct or booted off the bench. The actions of these vicious men are a violent stain on the community, and the full penalty of the law is hardly strong enough to deal with their ghastly crimes. A Texas Supreme Court judge had over 80 charges of misconduct on file against him when he resigned. It was even alleged that the judge had conspired to murder a business associate. Do you want justice? Not necessarily. And this same judge was later sentenced to five years in prison for lying to a grand jury. You promised to covet property, propriety, plurality, surety, security, and not hurt the state? Say what? What? <clears throat> Take your stand. Most judges who get into trouble abuse the powers of their office. The police have film of Dinsdale actually nailing your head to the floor. Oh yeah, he did that. An Alabama judge offered leniency to a female defendants in return for sex. I understand he also nailed your wife's head to a coffee table. Yeah, he did that. A Michigan judge ordered defendants to get haircuts exactly like his own in return for lowering their bail. He was a cruel man. But fair. And in New York, a judge sent the police after the courthouse coffee vendor. The handcuffed vendor was hauled into the court so the judge could complain about the quality of the coffee. I want to complain. You want to complain? Look at these shoes. I've only had them three weeks and the heels are worn right through. No, I want to complain. If about... you complain, nothing happens. You might as well not bother. Oh. Order in the courtroom. We love the law. Grab your habeas corpus. Order in the courtroom. People with complaints about judges now can have their day in court. And instead of telling it to the judge, they find the Judicial Conduct Commissions are ready to listen when someone wants to tell them about the judge. Order in the court! Thank you, thank you. I want no shenanigans in my courtroom. Please bring on the first case. Steve Crowley on the News Blimp.